What's up, family? Um, my brother, uh, Talk Zone Radio 411, he done a, a good job on two videos, you know, not two videos, it's this video I was watching. Uh, brother, brother went in, he talking about how a uh, black man is unfairly treated, you know, how we how we being treated in courts of law. When it comes to black men, the scale's always been, you know, unbalanced. It's not balanced when it comes to us living in living in America. You know, this is why it's so essential. Uh, we need to police our own communities. We need to stop this infighting. And we need to get our businesses and our franchises up to par and be entrepreneurs and stop playing these games, man. And stop buying into this illusion that we engaging in. Um, far as the views and the truth, people scared of the truth. I know there's a lot of people in the Negro sector, unquote, unquote. It's, it's due to entertainment, you know. And a lot of people just want to be entertained. They don't want to learn nothing. But I'm tell I'm telling you now, you keep you keep relishing in ignorance. You know, ignorance. It's not a good thing because it's going to catch up with you, especially when you get older. You know, if you want to stay on, you want to stay on the dumb dumb bus. That's on you. As far as views, yes, I can. You know, we speak the truth. We get a little bit of views. It's a shame, but that shows you a lot of people don't want no knowledge, man. But like I like I keep telling folks, you you want to work, <laughs> you run away from knowledge. It's gonna bite you in the ass in the long run. It's gonna hurt you because knowledge is the key. You know what I'm saying? Without that, you just you just jipping your own self. You know you can't blame no one but yourselves. You know because you won't accept you won't accept God's most high. You won't accept, you won't, you don't want to accept your calling. you running from your calling, you know, and that's a shame. Brothers, we, got, we still got a long way to go, brothers, a long way to go. And the black community... You see what's going on with Bill Cosby. You see what's going on with this entertainment. Is it helping? You see what's going on with these celebrities. Is it helping? I'm talking about the melanated people. Is it? Is it helping us? And that's like he said, we always looking for a martyr. We always looking for a king, an ex, mega Elvis. We always looking for all them civil rights movement people who, who you know, they 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 fought the powers that be. You know what I'm saying? They was going against the the system. We we. We always looking for an individual, you know, someone like a minister Louis Farrakhan that's prevalent that's still on this plane. We always looking for leaders and stuff instead of being leaders of our own community individually, you know. We always looking for that. It takes a village, not just one person. We always want to put someone on a pedestal, you know, and then they get executed and assassinated, and then we cry boo hoo, you know. That wouldn't happen if all of us, you know, arm ourselves in the right way, you know, direct our uh, ammunition in the right way, protect our own community in the, in the right way, instead of taking the very thing the suppressor sells to you, your gun owner, your gun store sells to you, or your legal or your legal arms dealer. You take the very thing, brothers and sisters. You take the very great equalizer and turn it against yourselves and, and kill yourselves. How stupid is that? And y'all the same ones talking about it's hard, you know, it's white supremacy, it's it's this and that, but you want to kill your neighbor, you want to kill your brother, you want to kill your sister, vice versa, vice versa, same sex, opposite sex, whatever. Engaging in violence. So, I'm just, just giving y'all the diagnosis of it all and what I think about it. Uh, family, because it's 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 going to be a long hot summer, as usual. It's going to be people that check out as usual. You know, so go ahead and subscribe. 
to uh 411 talk zone radio or su subscribe to that guy if you haven't subscribed to him if you haven't subscribe because he kicks some knowledge and he's trying to wake the black men up and the black women okay the brother is a teacher he's articulate you know he comes out you know his wordplay is excellent he present himself in a intellectual way and he making some he, you know he make credible sense he's not up here bullshitting on youtube and wasting people's time but brother let me tell you something from you know from me to you keep on going man don't give up Keep on, you know, putting out that information, man. And I'm going to, you know, take care of my end, okay? Because these people need to get it, bro. These people really, these brothers uh, uh, definitely need to get it. Stop playing around. See, the problem is, like you said, it's the infrastructure. And we don't work together. And we got these people pimping us, man. You know, and we intellectual, I mean, we economic prostitutes. That's all we are. We working for the man. If you don't run no company, if you don't run no Fortune 500 companies, if you ain't the CEO, you are uh, you an economic prostitute. You may not want to look at it like that, but that's what you is, and you you being holed out until you run your own business. You know, that's the way it goes, bro. I'm gonna break it down in layman's terms. You know, if you don't run it, someone is running. You know, they're running rip raff on you, rod shot on you. Because you're not running it. They running it. And you got to take orders from them. You know? So, until we get, you know, until brothers get get, get it back, man. We got to get it back and start running house. Don't be, don't be mad. Because this is why, see, it's, see, the women, the very women y'all complain about, the reason why they act like that, because we acting like simps, the vast majority of us. And that's true. I ain't talking about myself. I'm talking about those who engage in that activity. And they is going to see y'all as weak, man. So they give up. Because a lot of black jokers is not a challenging the establishment. And we hurting ourselves as black men. And our women say, what the hell, man? Look, look at our men. They getting weak, so the hell with them. That's why they get on social media. And that's that gives them an excuse, which is wrong. That gives That gives them... It's, you know, the excuse to get on social media and rant and rave, which is wrong. I don't agree with that. Because all black men, like myself, ain't in that category, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. That's another video. But this is my, you know, this is my take on this system as far as being unjust when it comes to black men and um, how content creators like me and others, like uh, 411, is is uh like needles in a haystack you know we got you know our channels you know got some 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 good scores on them but our channels should be way bigger than they are you know my channel should be views should be up there subscribers should be up there so is his and others but that tells you a lot of people don't want the truth they want to live a fantasy that tells you just by that that tells you a lot of people don't want to live. They, they want to live in this illusion. They want to live in a fantasy land. All they want to do is be entertained, and that's it. And, and that's it. They don't want to go no further than that. Oh man, don't rock the boat, man. This is this is America. Everything is everything. By and by, that's it. They think that it's, that it's excuse the fact and sweep everything under the rug. They they they, they don't. They, as long as, you know, so long as not their family members or not them individuals. So long. They not up in the courthouse. So long, they ain't being brutalized. That's it. I got mine. Get yours. It is what it is. I feel, you know, no remorse, you know, no compassion. You know, it's your fault, Negro. You're in a position. That's why you're in the position you is. Ain't no help. Ain't no Ain't no one throwing a, throwing a, a lifesaver out there. Nothing. You know, there's people that's cold today, man. They ain't looking out for each other. And that's why. The black race is still at a certain level. And other races surpass us and in the food chain and everything that goes with it. Because we keep we, we keep each other back. We still had a slave, slave backstabbing mentality, some of us. Mental slavery, bro. So more on these kind of subjects. I hope y'all get something out of my commentary. Peace and love to y'all. I'm out of here.